Yo, what's going on? Going on, guys. And welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Tony Ferguson versus Michael Chiesa. Tony Ferguson is 25 and 10. Huge losing streak, I believe, at seven losses in a row. He was 25 and 3 before this. He's 40 years old as of February 12th. Now, again, if you look at it, he's fought the best of the best. Plus 320 underdog is unbelievable to me. I know Tony hasn't looked great. 5'11 with a 76 and a half inch reach, uh, uh, reach fighting, Jesus, fighting uh, Michael Chiesa, who's 16 and 7, 2 and 3 in his last five fights. All right, come on. Minus 410 favorite with a 30, 36 years old, 6'1 with a 75 and a half inch reach, 1 inch reach advantage for Tony El Kukui. Ferguson. Again, if you look at it, Ferguson's fought better competition. Michael Chiesa's fought decent competition. He's on a three-fight losing streak as well. Ten submissions. He's also been submitted five times. 11-7, and seven, he's lost five submissions in the UFC. Uh, Kevin Howland submitted him. Vicente Luque submitted him. Pettis submitted him. And Kevin Lee submitted him. And Jorge Masvidal was the first loss of his career. Darce choke. One second left in round number two. He finishes him. The issue with Michael Chiesa is he can have good moments, but he always puts himself in bad positions. Now, three-fight losing streak against Luke, when back when Luke was good. Sean Brady and Holland is nothing to hold your dad, head down on at all. Those are good fighters. But that's not the competition Ferguson is fighting. You know, you have Patty Pimblett, Bobby Green, Nate Diaz, Michael Chandler, Darius. The worst one out of the bunch is probably Nate Diaz, rankings-wise. You know, Gaethje's great. Also, he cut weight two times for that fight. For that fight. Cut weight three times. And I believe two weeks or something like that. Something like that. Loses to Gaethje, loses to Oliveira, loses to Darius, Chandler, uh, Diaz, Green, Pimblet. Okay, Gaethje had, had a good moment. Almost finished Gaethje. Did nothing against Oliveira, Darius. Almost dropped Chandler twice in the first round. Uh, had success against Diaz with the late kicks. Dropped Bobby Green in the first round. Had Pimblet uh, uh, shooting takedowns from the other side of the octagon. He wanted nothing to do with that... that uh, that uh, uh, striking of, of uh, uh, Tony Ferguson. I just, it's so crazy because I trust Ferguson more than I trust Kiesa. I don't trust Kiesa because Kevin Holland put pressure on him, made him go against the cage, and he shot a terrible takedown and got submitted. I mean, there's these moments where he's having success, having success, and then he crumbles. I trust El Kukui more than I trust Michael Chiesa. And as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you are picking. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.